The Pratt and Amp Whitney F100 is an after-burning turbofan engine manufactured by Pratt and Amp Whitney which powers the F15 Eagle and F16 Fighting Falcon development. In 1967, the United States Navy and United States Air Force issued a joint engine request for proposals for the F14 Tomcat and F15 Eagle fighters. The combined program was called Advanced turbine engine gas generator with goals to improve thrust and reduce weight to achieve a thrust to weight ratio of 9. The program requested proposals and would award Pratt and Amp Whitney a contract in 1970 to produce F100PW100 and F401PW400 engines. The Navy would cut back and later cancel its order, choosing to continue to use the Pratt and Amp Whitney TF30 engine from the F111 in its F14 variants. F100PW100 The F100-100 first flew in an F15 Eagle in 1972 with a thrust of 23,930 lbf. Due to the advanced nature of engine and aircraft, numerous problems were encountered in its early days of service including high wear, stalling and hard afterburner starts. These hard starts could be caused by failure of the afterburner to start or by extinguishing after start. In either case the large jets of jet fuel were lit by the engine exhaust resulting in high pressure waves causing the engine to stall. Early problems were solved in the F100PW220 and the engine is still in the USAF fleet to this day. The F-16 Fighting Falcon entered service with the F-100-200, with only slight differences from the minus 100. Seeking a way to drive unit costs down, the USAF implemented the Alternative Fighter Engine Program in 1984 under which the engine contract would be awarded through competition. The F-16C, D-Block 30-30 S were the first to be built with the common engine bay able to accept the existing engine of the General Electric F-110, F-100 PW-200 and 2220th C. Due to the unsatisfactory reliability, maintenance costs and service life of the F-100 PW-100 and 200ths, Pratt and Amp Whitney was eventually pressured into upgrading the engine to address these issues. The resulting engine, designated F-100 PW-220, almost eliminates stall stagnations and augmenter instability as well as doubling time between depot overhauls. Reliability and maintenance costs were also drastically improved, and the engine incorporates a digital electronic engine control. The F-100 PW-220 was introduced in 1986 and could be installed on either an F-15 or F-16. A non-afterburning variant, the F-100 PW-220U powers the Northrop Grumman X-47B UCAV. The E abbreviation from 220 e is for equivalent. The abbreviation is given to engines which have been upgraded from series 100 to 200 to 220, thus becoming equivalent to 220 specifications. The first minus 229 was flown in 1989 and has a thrust of 17,800 lbf and 29,100. 160 lbf with afterburner. It currently powers late model F-16S and the F-15E Strike Eagle. Using technology developed from the F-119 and F-135 engine programs for the F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning II, the current production F-10 PW229E EP incorporates modern turbine material materials, cooling management techniques, compressor aerodynamics, and electronic controls. Deliveries of the 229 EEP began in 2009. Applications 
F-100 General Dynamics F-16 Fighting Falcon McDonnell Douglas F-15 Eagle McDonnell Douglas F-15E Strike Eagle Northrop Grumman X-47B Vought YA-7F F-401 Grumman F-14B Tomcat Rockwell XFV-12 Vought Model 1600 Specifications Data from General Characteristics Type After Burning Turbofan Length 191 inches Diameter 34.8 inches Inlet 46.5 inches Maximum External Dry weight 3,234 pounds. Components compressor, dual spool axial compressor, bypass ratio 0.631. Combustors, annular, performance maximum thrust 14,590 pounds, force military thrust 23,770 pounds, force with afterburner. Overall pressure ratio, 25 to 1. Specific fuel consumption, military thrust, closing parenthesis dot, thrust to weight ratio, data from general characteristics type, after burning turbofan, length, 191 inches, diameter, 34.8 inches inlet, 46.5 inches maximum external. Dry weight, 3,740 pounds. Components Compressor, Dual Spool Axial Compressor with 3 Fan and 10 Compressor Stages. Bypass Ratio, 0.361. Combustors, Annular, Turbine, 2 Low Pressure and 2 High Pressure Stages. Performance maximum thrust, 17,800 pounds force military thrust, 29,160 pounds force with afterburner. Overall pressure ratio, 32 to 1. Turbine inlet temperature, 2,460 degrees Fahrenheit. Specific fuel consumption, military thrust, 0.76 pounds, full afterburner, 1.94 pounds, thrust to weight ratio, 7.81. Bibliography. Fernandez, Ronald, XS Profits, The Rise of United Technologies, Boston, Massachusetts, USA, Addison Wesley, ISBN 9780201111. Dot.